Hey, hello guys! Welcome back to another video. Now, I'm just gonna be, you know, posting random videos, you know? No, so this is my first voice video. I'm a bit nervous, but I hope you guys can support me here. Here, and today we are gonna be a doing a video about how can you basically just a physics game like that but you know what you mean yeah that's just me being me yeah anyways um i'm gonna be delving into creations that's just made by me because um off camera i've been making a lot of creations cool planes and stuff so stuff you know right so let's dive into it right away and so it'll be fun so the first thing yeah i have this is a lot a lot but the first thing we're gonna be doing is a creation called DSS Permission. I'm gonna be show off showcasing three creations today. So, and this is my first one, which is basically a ship. It has a unique turning system. And if I remember how to control it correctly, yeah, there it is. It, is, it has something that in real life is called a reaction system where one object spins and count makes uh, another object counteracted so we can fly around here using a thruster using a thruster thruster notice that gravity is turned off here yeah we are in a non-low gravity environment here um, so yeah, that's pretty much it about this. And it's also pretty cool. And I hope you also like it. it. And next one. Uh, let's see, city, ah, maybe I'll try Jeez, this one. So, this is something that's called Trailmaker Engines. Trailmaker is just another video game. It's not something I made. And so, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, that was... <laughs> yeah, um, I think you not get it, but it's just made of cursed stuff. So, the first of all we have here is something called a Bulldog Engine. Engine. You can see it in work here. Here, lots of gears and moving parts. This is, um, if you might be a, a little bit confused, but... This one is powered by a motor. Only if I can see it, which one is the motor. But yeah, basically there's like an axle. Axle. This is an axle where it's like a bearing point where objects can spin. And it's spinning on this axis. And there's this other thing here that is being powered here. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's brake or not. That's brake. This is like a axle or or network connection that also causes this gear to spin. It's a gear that powers this other gear to spin in the opposite direction of this gear. Here and this gear to spin in the same direction as this gear. You know, odd and even numbers. It's a bit like odd and even numbers. You know. And then, the next thing, we have a raw engine, which looks extremely big. 
B. Yeah, but yeah, but that's just how it works. Works. It's a different engine that has very low acceleration. Yet again, same system. Different workings. And the fire for now here. I saved the best for last. This is the most powerful engine. This one is the most powerful engine. So Q and E. Yeah. So when you start spinning the the power generators, you see it starts to spin very gradually. But as soon as I press E, which is the locking system, it comes pretty extreme extreme it's very powerful like it can actually kind make kind of power anything else like it can power anything else um although if it's secured tightly yeah it's just all the engines here that works works a bulldog engine has a very high acceleration but a very low top speed this one has Low acceleration, but high top speed. However, for this one is a big boy. High acceleration, high top speed. So this may be your choice when you want to put something on a car or like that. But yeah, that's just everything about this. Now, on my last creation, creation I'm just gonna scroll here. Here. I think this one is gonna be. I think I'll do this one. This one. A car that. This is a car that uses. Well, James. Yeah, just James. Obviously. You see, it's powered by a change here, but. It asked me, but for some reason it's moving very randomly. That's because the physics here. Physics in Algodoo doesn't work as physics in real life, obviously. And put a box down here. And it will obviously um just Yeah. Yeah. This also has inbuilt suspension. And yeah. This, um, yeah, uh, <laughs> don't ask about this, I tried to make rails, but they got broken, good, so let's take this out for a spin, shall we, um, D for drive forward, yeah, let's disable the bricks, I mean the brakes, First, and then we turn this on, and the gears. Um, actually, the gears are just gently pushing against this wheel. Wheel. It's not the physics are very, not are not very strong here, but this thing is just pushing against this, and it looks like it's going pretty strong. Oh, also, so. Um, it says A is to race with payload. Ah, uh, yeah. No, it's not strong enough because of the wind resistance. Resistance. After a few moments. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, the, the, the chain got a little bit weird there. Oh, it's starting to go crazy here. Here, um. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I got it. I got it under control now. No, um, the suspension. Unfortunately, it's the suspension is not. Oh no, the gears are broken. I realized that. Engage the brakes. This one is actually the one doing the most work. Yeah, it's just going crazy now. 
Now, um, is it going to a halt? Yes, it is. Oh, I forgot. Um, all right, so there it is. All three showcases of Algadoo. This is still broken, though. Uh, the lights, uh, and it's blocking the lights as well. I don't know why, but this thing is still spinning. Spinning. Suspension held up pretty well. Well, and that's it. There's also a door handle here. Yeah. Oh, I forgot. Payload. Alright, that's it, guys. Thank you. I hope you guys like and subscribe right here and most likely i'll see you next time bye